and it didn't roll over for me. You get what I'm saying? So this lingo exists. Everybody, let's not say, but like I said, I didn't use no derogatory lingo because I didn't call them. I could have called them the this word for gangsters. I could have called them a T word. I could have called them anything, but I'm not finna disrespect my friend that I'm defending to a fuck nigga ever in life, no matter if he represent the same thing of me or not. A fuck nigga, once a fuck nigga, always a fuck nigga. Fuck nigga. Rick Baby has officially entered the zone of going back and forth with what he should be focused on. We should all be able to relate to the fact this has to be a tough situation for Brick Baby with multiple angles of attack on his character in public. The only thing that Brick Baby is doing wrong is not staying committed to a certain path. We are all aware that on that phone call with Sporty Face, whether it was recorded or not, Brick Baby was not speaking highly on the insane members and DW Flames. Why is Brick Baby all of a sudden defending the term that was once viewed as unacceptable? Is the reason why Brick Baby used the term himself earlier? Because he wanted to show that it isn't that big of a deal when used? Does Brick Baby think that he can change the way that members view politics oh, and disrespect in words? Now to the 